Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am Grimwit. This is an introduction to Gothage. Gothage is a game in which we are playing Ryutama. Ryutama is an RPG very much in the style of JRPGs with more emphasis on travel than on combat. It is more akin to Oregon Trail than it is to Conan the Barbarian in which everybody has to worry about food, water, travel states, weather, terrain, etc. Although this first episode was completely lost, so the second episode does have more to do with combat than anything else. In Ryutama, players are encouraged to, to take part on how the world works and is defined. Although everything is pretty much run by dragons, such as nature, weather, terrain, the world when it's generated is done so with player input. So the players literally helped make the world of Gothage. Now the world of Gothage is the underside of a coin-like world called Dosaidos. Gothage is actually two separate countries. The main country, which is Gothage, the world was named after it, has been around for thousands of years and for thousands of years was the only country. It is ruled by 13 noble classes. One of the noble classes kind of got bored with the stuck-up politics and slow bureaucratic nature of the country and so supposedly had separated and formed his new country known as New Salem. And New Salem is nicely surrounded by mountains. Whereas Gothage is its normal country with its, um, with its farms and its worries about, I guess, monsters. I don't know, we haven't got far into the actual country of Gothage. New Salem deals more in new minerals and resources, and so has found a pretty good handle on trade with Gothage. But the politics between the two countries are a little strange. New Salem is currently run by three brothers known as the Sons of Sam, and that's Gordon Hain, Wimple Hain, and Princeton Hain. They most of the time reside in New Salem's capital city known as <sighs> Pound Town. I didn't name the cities. I have named none of the cities. One of the brothers, Gordon Hain, has asked the players to go to the Tower of Thra where his brother, Whipple Hain, is doing research on the supposed keys of Gothage to see if it's possible to gain an advantage over the elder country. And so our adventures are following one of the great roads of Gothage, the Road of Ray, to the Tower of Thra, and they are to give his brother a hug for additional gold. That's a thing that happened as well. The first leg of their journey will be to leave New Salem and enter into Fort Starbutt. So, the characters. So, so far the characters are pretty much named after the people who are running them. This game has taken less of an epic feel and more of a frat party feel, but adventure is still adventure. We have Walrus, who is played by Darth Walrus. He is an artisan who creates armors for Houndoru's company, which is played by Lightning Hound. Queenie, my wife, is the shop's mascot. She is playing a Koneko, which is very much like a cat goblin. She is a healer class, which deals mostly in herbs, and she does know a bit of magic. Eliza and Nordy's characters are twin hunters that go out and gather materials for the shop. 
The shop is more or less, although he isn't the leader of the group, run by Hound and his character Houndaru, who is a, a merchant obsessed with profit. He also, Houndaru, owns Wilson, a dapper orangutan with a monocle and a top hat. That's their pack animal. Finally, uh, and a little late to the scene, is Zombie, a noble who has overheard the group's mission of finding the so-called Keys of Gothage, and is now tagging along to make sure that there could be some advantage for his noble house in New Salem. He's also super stabby. Alright, that should catch you up to the session as it's going so far. The game is still in its early stages, and surely absurdity is to follow. I shall banish their souls to everlasting damnation.